Do you remember the last time you experienced challenges in your life or difficult situation? Or are you going through one right now? One thing I want you to understand is this, that we usually don't excited about going through them. But in fact, when trouble comes, we sometimes ask, why is this happening to me? Why is this thing happening to him? Why is this thing happening to our family member? Many times, things happen that we simply don't understand. But that's okay. God doesn't expect us to have everything figured out. That's what makes us a man. And that's what makes him God. We can never know what he has in mind at any particular time. We can trust that he knows and will take care of everything. He himself as God, he wants us to look to him and say, God, I have no idea what I can do or what I'm going through, but I'm trusting on you. He wants us to put all our trust, all our hope, all our everything onto him. Because he alone is the only God who can save us. He alone is the only one who knows the beginning and the end of our challenges. He alone is the only one who has the solution to the problem we are passing through. And only him alone wants to take glory and for providing solution to our challenge. And only him alone will provide solution to our challenge. Man cannot do it. Though man can do it through God. Because the Spirit of God lives in all of us. Please, if you are still new to my channel, kindly do me a favor, sus click the subscription button and subscribe. Like this video, share it to your friends and help your brother to grow. God bless you as you do. Let's go. In every situation we may be facing today, the only thing God expected from me and you is to trust in Him. Let's put all our trust in Him Believing that he's here alone is the only one that can solve it. But if you have put your trust in man, that is where disappointment will come. If you have another alternative inside you, take for example, you are in a big situation now, but you still believe, what's the need of hoping on God when I still have, it, have it, a way to solve it? God will not come. God will only come when you have no any other choice. When you only have him alone as the only person who can save you. When you have no other hope, that's when God comes. And that's when your faith will become more strong in God. Because the, God, the truth is that when we are facing difficult situations that we don't understand, one of the best things we can do is to trust God. It allows him, the God himself, to take the wrong things that we are facing. He will take the wrong things that is happening to us and work them out for our benefit. As it was said in the book of Romans 8, verse 23, he says, And we know that all things God works for the good of those who love him, who have been called according to his purpose. We can trust that he is with us through every challenge we may face. We are ultimately going to come out stronger at the end because he remains the God we believe. We can also trust that he is with us through every challenge we face and we are ultimately going to come out stronger at the end. So far we believe. Because the Bible says, over the years, God has taught me so much about what it means to trust him. For example, I really had to trust God when he told me to quit my job so I could stay home and study God's word more, more and more. I trusted in him. Even though God was preparing me for full-time ministry, it was a hard decision to take. Very, very hard decision to take. Because, <laughs> if I tell you it was easy, 
is a lie. Because you have to contend with the expenditure, the expenses of house rent, family, and so on. Everything needs money. It was very hard because we were short of money in the house. Each month, everything we need to pay bill is short. For six years, we had to live at the mercy of people. We survive only by the miracle. Finances that come from different friends. And it didn't make any sense to me at all why it was taking so long for breakthrough to come. But God was teaching me how to trust Him for everything. I look back now, I know that God was using this situation for my good and preparing me to do what I am doing now in the ministry. As you can see, God is wonderful. So because of that, I have learned from personal experience that putting my trust in God means there will be some unanswered questions that may be difficult to answer. Which only God himself can answer them. Even man cannot answer them. Because we are human. 